welcome you all to this video. In the previous video, we learned to draw tangents on a circle from a point outside the circle. Today in this video, we will see examples based on this concept. Draw tangent lines to the circle at a point K located at a distance of 10 cm from the center of the circle of radius 5 cm. First, consider a point P as center. Draw a circle of radius 5 cm. Now let's take a point K at a distance of 10 cm from the center which gives the line segment PK. Can you tell what step should we take next? Now we will bisect the line segment PK from which we get the midpoint M of the line segment PK. Now let PM or MK be the radius. Let's draw a circle from the point M which intersects the first circle at point S and T. From point K, draw lines through point S and T. The tangents are KS and KT. The ST and KT are two tangents that we had to create. Let us see another example based on the tangent lines of a circle. Draw two tangent lines on a circle with center O in such a way that an angle of 60 degrees is made between the two. Can you tell what is different in this question? Like every question, in this question also we have a circle and know about its center. But in this question, we have not been told the distance between the outer point and the center of the circle. But the angle formed between the tangent lines is described. Come, let's see how we can solve this type of question. First of all, what we'll do is, we'll make a rough diagram for this. In which a circle, whose center is O, which has two tangents, let them be PA and PB, between whom an angle of 60 degrees is formed. Now we can take these points A and B and connect them to center O, which gives us the quadrilateral PAOB, in which the angle APB is 60 degrees and angles PAO and PBO are right angles. Because PA and PB are tangent lines and OA and OB are the radii of the circle. Can you tell the value of angle AOB? Absolutely right. The sum of the four angles of a quadrilateral is 360 degrees. Therefore, the value of angle AOB will be 120 degrees. In this way, we complete our rough diagram. Let us begin with the actual diagram, keeping this rough image in mind. First of all, consider point O as the center. Let's draw a circle of an appropriate radius. Now draw two radii, OA and OB, making an angle of 120 degrees. Now the tangent lines passing through these two points A and B have to be drawn. Can you draw a tangent from a point given on a circle? We know that tangent line is perpendicular to the radius. So we draw perpendiculars from point A and B. The two intersect each other at point P on extending them. Thus, we get two desired tangents PA and PB. On checking, you will find that the angle APB between the tangents PA and PB is 60 degrees. Today in this video, we saw some interesting examples based on the construction of tangent lines on a circle. Hope you have understood very well how to draw tangent lines on a circle.